Hey guys, so I never finished my vlog last night. Um, I actually ended up bumping into somebody that um, I haven't seen in ages. I used to do a lot of work with them um, and it was just really nice to catch up and we ended up chatting and then I just didn't vlog again and I came home really late and had had a few drinks and I forgot to finish my vlog. Today, it's about half past eight and I've just been pottering around, tidying up the flat and everything um, and actually catching up on YouTube. Like, I haven't watched a lot of YouTube videos in ages and so I've just been like kind of catching up on YouTube and just stalking people basically stalking people on the internet we all do it that's why you're watching a vlog right now um so yeah just catching up on what everybody's doing i'm also um i'm going to get my nails done because i'm off to coachella on tuesday with keels and they've actually invited me over to get my nails done today or this morning um and then i've got somebody who's been helping me source a load of clothes for a lookbook that I'm going to shoot in Coachella is coming over and we're having like a big try on session um, because the past couple of weeks have been super super busy I haven't had a chance to actually like do that myself so um, yeah we've been like emailing 50 emails a day trying to like work it all out so um, that is what's happening today pretty chill day to be honest I've got a lot of editing to do but I'm kind of putting it off because um, I'm tired I haven't got any food in the flat either and I'm gonna go out and get some breakfast probably so that is the update it's not very exciting and on another note I just made my bed and then I've lied down on it during this vlog and I now realize how annoying that is because I'm gonna have to remake the bed well just like even out I'm annoying myself, this is bizarre. I'm just about to start doing my makeup and I wanted to show you this um, new chest that I got in the flat. Hello, there's me. <laughs> um, this is actually from made.com. This is kind of like a sneak peek. My voice is, I've like basically lost my voice from last night from talking so much. Um, but yeah, so excuse that. This is gonna be in um, the flat tour at some point when that actually goes up. But I wanted to show you this because it's really cool. Um, it's from Made, and then the top comes up and you've got like a little makeup station and here's all my makeup inside. I'm gonna do my makeup and I'm also watching, my phone's just gone off, but I'm watching Tamara's um, March favorites from the Glamour Glitter, which is like, this is what I'm currently watching. I've watched about 10 YouTube videos in a row. Let's play. There we go. So I've just finished my makeup. This is what it looks like. Pretty damn minimal today. I've used my Chanel Vitalumia Aqua Foundation, standard for me, really. Um, and then I've used my Charlotte Tilbury Secret Salma Matte Lipstick, which actually isn't out until the summer. This is one of the new colours that I got at an event recently. And I really like it. It's quite, um, it's quite like a blush, like a deep blush pink. I really like it. And then my MAC, I don't even know what this is called because it doesn't have it on written on it. Um, the MAC Mascara. <laughs> This one, the one that looks like this. I don't know the name of it. <laughs> um, it's really good actually. And then um, my NARS blush in Orgasm. This is like a mini one that I got when they did a collaboration with Glossy Box. It's super cute. And then I've used a little bit of the Urban Decay 24-7 um, liner in Roach. So that's what my makeup looks like, a little bit tired. My blow dry is still going from yesterday. Are you one of those people, like this drives me bananas. You know when you see people that like get a blow dry once a week, every week, and they don't wash their hair in between and their hair stays perfect. Like how do people do that? Because quite frankly, I this is like going good for me to have a blow dry kind of semi going on to the next day. Like I feel like if I, Went for a run this morning, KO, KO. My hair would just be crazy. But even like when I sleep on it, it goes crazy. Like even at the front here, it's a bit, it's a bit wild, isn't it? Um, but yeah, how do you how do you make your hair last? Like I think it just depends how you sleep as well. Cause I'm a really like rough sleeper. Like I sleep a lot of the time, like face down, I'm like rolling around. I move a lot in the night, so I'm kind of like, my hair's never gonna stay looking amazing. I wish I was one of those people. So this is where I'm going to get my nails done. It's called Paul Edmonds in Knightsbridge and it's beautiful, it looks super swanky. So this is the color I went for. It's so pretty. Far east, like one to the area or anywhere like that. I've just finished having a manicure and a pedicure and I feel so pampered because I never ever get my nails done and I got gels done as well so they're gonna last the whole trip. I literally feel amazing. I could go back to bed, I'm so relaxed. But I went for this colour on my nails, which is called Saltwater Happy. Um, and then I got a coral on my toes, so feeling very colourful and spring-like. I've just spent the past four hours, yep, four hours, um, doing styling stuff for Coachella. And I didn't want to show you guys because I want it to be a surprise for the lookbook and stuff, but um, it's been a little bit gruelling. I've tried on about 
50 million outfits, bit of an exaggeration, but quite a lot. Um, and yeah, so I'm now on my way to my friend Sam and Lauren's joint birthday party. You guys might know, like, because they're in vlogs quite a lot, but they're actually a couple, but their birthdays are two days apart, which works out really well, so they have, like, this amazing party every year. Um, so I thought I would do a quick outfit of the day in the back of the cab, which is not the most ideal place to do an outfit of the day, but, you know, Mike's not with me yet, he's coming separately. So, I have on, this looks really odd, I have on my Chloe Drew bag, which is crossbody, so I'm going to take that off. And then I have on my All Saints coat which is like this really pretty like beigey kind of taupe colour and then my shirt which is really it creases really easily um, but I really like it this is from monkey it has like this pleating detail at the waist and then like a waistband um, which I got via ASOS then I have on some black skinny ripped jeans I'm gonna turn the camera around and do it this way some black skinny ripped jeans which are Zara and then these boots which I actually got um, for Coachella and I just put them straight on um, they're from Hudson and they're, I think they're really really nice they're like a kind of tan grey suede um, so I thought they were cool and then I also have Sam and Lauren's um, birthday presents which are these they're like well, they could be used as like a terrarium or they could be used for candles but I just really like them and they have a lot of copper in their house so I thought they would like these they're like um, quite kind of cool and like oddly geometric kind of style they've also got a fragrance each from um, the replica the Maison uh, Margiela replica they've got a girls one and a boy one so they've got like matching presents not matching cards but matching presents um, but Mike's bringing those because I left them at home because he's driving down so he's got way more space. I'm going to touch my makeup up now. Um, and yeah, I am not, still not feeling super fresh after last night. It was quite late, quite boozy. And I'm not really feeling on tip top form for round two, but we'll get there. And I also just realised that I swapped my handbag over to bring my Chloe bag out with me today. And I left all of my makeup in my bigger handbag. So I'm not going to touch up my makeup. I'm just going out looking like this, which it's not too bad I feel like it could be better I don't have any lip product on um, and I'm probably gonna do a bit of concealer under my eyes but oh well it's very dark and very noisy in here so I don't know if you haven't seen me but we've got some yummy fajitas and look who I found hello right love we're in the back of an uber right now we and we just left the party I didn't vlog because it was in a very very noisy bar very noisy I feel like my voice but is vanishing I feel like be very groggy. I had no voice this morning. I don't know what I'm going to sound like tomorrow morning. I can't morning. wait. I, can you please film a video with a voice like tomorrow? I lose my voice like so easily. Voice. Yeah, like, what do you mean? Hello, Batman. guys. Batman. <laughs> Batman. My name's Christian Bale. Christian Bale. Although Ben Affleck's playing Batman, yeah. isn't he? But the apparently... Pan, his voice isn't... His yeah, it's fake. Voice is we fake watched voice. that together. Okay, I didn't know you were awake. <laughs> I thought you were asleep at that point. But, um... My, my interesting fact. Whereas Christian Bale actually did the voice. Yeah, thing. that's because he's an actor. But he does acting. Um... So, Mike was just telling me about the escapades uh, of Piglet, Piglet today. So, basically today, I have done... I can't remember whether we vlogged it last year or not, but the little sort of pond that we have at home is really filled with weeds. And so I put Barley Straw in to kill the weeds. Really boring story. So you were like out and about Out and about day. doing stuff today. And Piglet has been bumbling around me all day long. She's literally circling the pond, having a whale at the time. Got to about half an hour before I wanted to leave and I saw her just dart into one of the bushes. I was like, okay, no problem. She won't be in there for long. Won't be there for long. And she hasn't been Sure. Long. Turns out she was in there for a long time. So got to four o'clock, I was supposed to leaving. And I could hear her bumbling around. Going. Going like, arr, arr, <laughs> or like, arr. like what? <laughs> Give me that. Um, so I kind of, I thought she's now, like, oh, I need to shower, I need to get ready. So I went upstairs, got ready, got out of the shower, got changed. And as I was getting changed, I heard her barking. So I was like, ah, oh, she'll be downstairs, couldn't see her. Went out there, she was still in this bush. I literally spent an hour trying to find her in this bush, found her, and I had to dig. Like, I'm not kidding. Okay, so if. Can you hold the camera in my arms really tight? Okay. okay, so if, say, if Fleur's bottom of Fleur's head is the floor, think probably. I'd say six times the size of your head is how deep down she was in this bush. What? Are you kidding me? It's a, it's a big bush. And literally, when I picked it out, if. If my hand was this far away from from Piglet, I couldn't see her at all. It was ridiculous. She was that buried, dug in stuff. But as I pulled it out, she had like mud inside her teeth, 
and there's a bit of blood all over her teeth. And I think what she was chasing it's was a rabbit. little bunny rabbit she was chasing. Whether she, she ate it or not. She gave it a bit of a bite on uh, the She bum definitely gave it a tickle. And oh dear, someone's very horny. Um, and someone's horny. They got the horn out. And, <laughs> <laughs> um, and so basically, as I pulled her out of this hole that I kind of pulled her out of, she. It was ridiculous. She literally would not come out of this hole. I got her out. She was filthy, so disgustingly dirty. I didn't Snapchat this out this. I kind of didn't have time. And I got her out, put her on the floor, and she just about turned to go straight back in where she was coming from. So, so she was obviously after something. She's got that attitude. I was so fuming with her. So I finally got her inside. I had to then bath her. I put her in the sink. That wasn't good enough. Couldn't get her clean enough in the what? sink. Oh had to go gosh. upstairs into the. You know, I that much know, so, bad. so I went up into the bath. Had to then like shampoo her. And then she then spent her entire like 10 minutes whilst I was getting ready, just running around the bedroom, drying herself on the new carpets. So that what was nice. What You should have taken her downstairs. She was clean at that point, so it was fine. Um, but it was ridiculous. So your dog, your dog, your dog. My dog. Made me an hour late. She's naughty. She's very naughty. My dogs, on the other hand, were well behaved. Top banana. Like, they're good hounds. And that was that. Give <laughs> me the camera. Are you struggling? I'm struggling because the seatbelt's hey. holding me in. Oh dear. <laughs>